Good morning. It is Friday morning. I, um, I'm i doing a whole bunch of prep, like cooking prep, and I'm gonna clean the whole house because tomorrow is Amelia's dedication. It's gonna be super fun and exciting and um, we have to be at the church at around 10 and our whole family's coming and, well not our whole family, but my parents, Johnny's mom, his grandma, and a bunch of our friends and it'll be a super good time. They're coming over here for lunch after. I bought a pork shoulder, so I'm gonna get that going and make sure this house is decent before everyone comes. So I thought I would include some of the prep in the video. I wanna make it like doing the prep the day before and then into tomorrow and some cute videos of um, just time with friends and family. So I hope you enjoy. Loving you. started soaking them yesterday soaked them overnight and now I am just cooking them they've been cooking since about six well, about seven o'clock this morning um I just want to get a good simmer on them so when I came home they weren't really simmering they were kind of just cooking in hot water so I brought it back up to a boiling and then turned the temperature down. Now I'm just going to cover it and let them cook. Um, I just use water and salt for my beans. Now I'm going to get the stuff in the crock pot. It looks like this is ready to sear the pork and I'll show you what I am going to cook the pork in. Loving you.
So I ended up getting stuck on the phone for like an hour and a half with insurance. And now I have to go to the grocery store. I'm going to Audi to pick up a few more things for the party on Saturday. Amelia is not happy with me. And then I'm gonna come back and clean some more. from the store. I'm gonna get these groceries put away. Try to put Amelia down for a nap. We'll see how that goes. And then um, finish up cleaning and prepping for tomorrow before we have to get the kids at two o'clock. So we got two hours to do everything. I think we can do it. If Amelia maybe naps or just plays and is content, hopefully. I think her teeth are about to come in because she's like, she's been really wanting to nurse a lot lately. And look at her, just like everything she's just like gnawing on. <laughs> I'm sorry, mommy does. Aww. <laughs> Groceries are put away. I'm hungry and I'm tired. <laughs> so I'm gonna have a little cup of leftover coffee from this morning and I'm making myself some quesadillas fried up in the pork fat from this morning. This tortilla is still going and I'm gonna have it with this Violife mozzarella shreds. It's um, vegan cheese, no dairy. Um, and yeah, it sounds delicious to me. I, oh my gosh. I was just thinking, like, I still have a good three quarters of the house to clean, but I'm like, no, I'm going to think positive. I got this half of the house clean, this larger portion, kind of, I still have to mop. Oh, <laughs> there's so much to do. But, um, I still got a good chunk of the day left and the kids can help me when they get home from school, right? Because, yeah. That's what they should do. <laughs> Wish me luck.
You're offering them? Hey, Let's see. Oh my goodness. Dump it out. Watch the baby. Ah! That one's for me? Uh-huh. It's your favorite. I do love Laffy Taffy. I do. Hey, Mama. I like her cute too. That's cute, right? <laughs> I really wanted to film more of this morning, but it didn't happen because my phone was dying. So, um, we have the pork. Heating up. That'll be ready for when we get back. And we have the beans in the oven. We are all magically ready before it's time to go. <laughs> Doesn't happen a lot. Usually we're like in a rush to get out the door. The girls are watching Dino Dana. I'm taking a video. There's Ezra. Say hi. We're on our way. She is. When was your birthday? Last Saturday. Sorry. Huh? And then get a picture out of the video. Screenshot. I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Your works are wonderful. I know that full well. Father, thank you for Amelia. Thank you for her life. That you have um, brought her into this wonderful and beautiful family. Her sister, mom and dad, to raise her and help form her to know who you are and what you desire for her. Lord, I pray for Amelia as she is, as she is raised up, trained up, equipped, that you would come into her story in a marvelous way that you display your unconditional love to her, and that you'd already be doing that even, even in the moments that she's not gonna remember in the years ahead, um, but they are formative moments in these early couple of years of childhood, that she, would, that she would accept such wonderful love from her parents, that she would see your love on display through their love, through their patience, through their graciousness, through their faithfulness. Yeah. Lord, we pray this for Amelia, and we pray that, uh, that she would come to experience your saving power, where you will one day wash away her sin white as snow, and that you would be magnified and glorified in her life. We pray that she would be raised to know, to, to know what it looks like to follow the way of Jesus, and that she would desire to follow that way imperfectly, but continuously. And that she would do it not by her power, not by the power of parents, by your power. And that's good news. So we pray, um, we pray for Johnny and for Michelle that as they are in this parenting journey, that they would love 
these two well, um, that they would repent well, that they would apologize when they're in the wrong well so the kids would know that you alone were. And that's good news. So Lord, we dedicate Amelia to you in the powerful name of Jesus today. Amen. Absolutely. Absolutely.